Okay, YouTube. This is my X2 setup. This is a uh, this is their 10 watt Pro um, uh, uh, laser engraver or laser kit. Uh, this is all the X2 stuff. I have the uh, RA2, which is the uh, rotary attachment. I'm gonna go over that. I have the air assist, and I also have the honeycomb working panel. And these are risers in this little bitty box. And here is the actual X tool. Now, uh, this isn't going to be like a tutorial or anything like that because, like I said, I'm learning as well. Um, so I can't teach you what I don't know. You know what I mean? But we won't, if you know that's on mine, you can sit here and I'll take this little journey together. All right. So with the uh, X tool 10 watt laser D1 Pro, um, this. This is it, man. Like I say, presentation is key. Uh, and this is a great presentation. This is once you open the box. And um, it gives you the instruction manual, which is a nice little kit. I'll go through that in a little bit. And they come in two boxes. I'm showing some other paperwork in there. Fill up the top layer of foam. I'm going to fill it up over the lid. Wow. Everything is neatly aligned in here. You have all your rails. There's your laser head. It's probably going to be tools and screws and a few other little minor accessories here. So, okay. So I'm going to, like I say, this is not me putting it together and none of that. I didn't see a lot of videos on the 10 watt. Everybody does videos on the 20 watt. And not only the 20 watt, but the Iron Man 20 watt. I didn't get the Iron Man. I went for the gray. Um, and I went for the 10 watt because this is all bought through my business. And at the time, this is what my business said you could afford. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and put this together and, um, and see what she looks like. All right, so I got everything out of the box, and that's what was in that little green box was uh, a pair of overseas made um, laser glasses. I have another pair on order. Uh, I'm not going to worry about those. Comes with the tool kit. Inside the tool kit, you see it's everything you need to put it together. Looks like a little, um, little screwdriver with. Uh, the ends go in and out. I have better screwdrivers than that, but air assist nozzle, memory card, nuts and bolts. They are color coded uh, with Loctite with uh, blue and red. Um, some Molly grease, which I also have some lithium, white lithium grease, cable ties, power brick, a USB cable, and a wire harness here. And again, here's all the rails. There, uh, with the belts already on them, a couple of stepper motors, and this one has the the uh, motherboard on it. So I'm going to go ahead and get this all put together. This one does have the new limit switches, uh, which aren't really switches; they're just uh, limit sensors. I'm going to get this put together. I'm not going to bore you guys with that. There's so many videos out there on how to put these together. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, should only take about 20 minutes. Um, so I'm going to get that done and we'll see what we have when I come back. Okay, so I got it all put together. And this is what we come up with. This is the front. Next to your notice is a button for when an alarm goes off. You set it there. Um, power switch.
So a little bit of engraving glasses, shot glasses, uh, business logo, friend of mine's testing out. And we'll see how it goes. D1 20 uh, 10 watt I'm sorry pro and I've done the extension on it and as you can see I have the old X2 original honeycomb so I wanted an extension it's not a lot of videos out there for an extension but I did find one on F on uh, Amazon and I thought I'd give it a try so right now I have something burning but I'm opening up the package for the new extension which just got which just got delivered so come check me out Alrighty, <laughs> not sure how good y'all can see that without trying to get everything in there. But here is the extension. This is made by Neville. And in their description, they said it specifically for the X2 uh, with the extension. Well, um, the extension uh, Y access. And it also comes with the metal plate which fits it so after a little bit of fine tuning there's my X2 D1 Pro 10 watt in its enclosure and LED lights up top four holes for ventilation two inch and another fan to exhaust the air out into the other fan that's on the back of this unit uh, I have the extension the Neville honeycomb and air hose and everything is going out the back. There's a slot in the back. Um, this is not laser rated glass. This is just tinted glass. Uh, it was clear plexiglass and I put orange tin on it. I keep my light, my, I always have my goggles on. Uh, keyboard here and mouse pad and calipers, air pump is on the back, outside of the unit, and a monitor, light burn off to the side on a removable stand. Uh, it's not a CO2 fire extinguisher, but at the moment it's what I have, but I'm pretty happy about this enclosure. Uh, opens up on right the front. So I can get all the way in there. Get that smell out of here. And I'm happy with it, man. Happy to see it's running, running, running well. <laughs> 